Listen, this revelation I'm about to drop is so deep and I might make a full video, but please listen to this with an open mind because it's gonna set some of you free. We as women are being groomed by many of these content creators to be prostitutes. What do you mean by that? Let me explain. I used to listen to a lot of this like hypergamy femininity content online, okay? The Sprinkle Sprinkle Lady, I knew about her like way before she blew up on TikTok, all right? I was there. I used to listen to her consistently. People like her, I would listen to, okay, she'd talk about the dusties and hypergamy and the kind of men you should be chasing. I used to listen to all of that before I got saved. Now listen, that content was making me so bitter and angry at men. We live in a generation where the modern day woman has become the modern day 304. Yeah. There is no difference between modern women and 304s. They both want money in exchange for time, effort, and energy. Stay tuned. <laughs> what's going on welcome to another video don't forget hit that like button on your way in tickle that notification bell that will allow you to know every time i upload new content and you know what we're gonna do say it with me y'all we're gonna roll that clip when you become bitter towards men when you become desensitized towards the fact that they are human beings and you start to hate them this is when you start to really listen to the women that tell you to only use men for their money to you know take him for everything he's worth to not care about love to not care about any of the things that make a relationship beautiful but to simply go after the money and even as i'm saying this some of you guys are going to feel angry at me some of you guys may feel tempted to call me uh, whatever it is, a pick me or be angry or rise up in your spirit and say, but what about men? Listen, you are being trained based on what you're consistently feeding your mind to desensitize yourself towards human beings. And because you have that hatred, because you are desensitized, that's when you go out and start to use men like how a prostitute would. What does a prostitute do? A prostitute sells her body in exchange for money, for material gifts. When you are dating a man or with a man, not because you care about him, not because you love him, but simply because of the lifestyle he can provide for you. Your heart isn't in it. Your head isn't in it. You are a prostitute. This woman makes sense. And the reason why this woman makes sense is because it's true. Modern women are the modern day prostitute. They're the modern day 304. Hey, yeah. This generation is nothing but a bunch of users. They're nothing but a bunch of 304s posing as good women. You see, if you look at how women are, what do they want? They want your money. They want your resources. They want everything. They want your lifestyle. They want the glamour, the fame, the fortune. And what do they give you in return? Their body. Their good looks. Their sex appeal. The modern woman is the modern day prostitute. Let's keep it a bump. That's the reason why women and society as a whole is causing modern women to become 304s, ladies of the night. If you look on TikTok and YouTube, what are women teaching other women to do? Hey, yeah. No man should ever feel like your time is worth $20. It's just about the effort. How long does it take you guys to drink coffee? Maybe like like five to eight minutes. After you drink the coffee, what are you going to be doing? Biting your fingers, playing footsie? If he's offering you coffee on the first day, you can only imagine the minimum of effort he's going to put later down the line. 
Get a man with money. Get a man with resources. Get a man with power. Get a man that has a lifestyle. No coffee dates. No low budget dates. Get a man who's going to put up tons of money on the first date. But yet you want to sit and say, I deserve a man that makes 100K or more a year, but yet you're not worthy of 100K. You're not worthy of that at all. You're just a modern day 304 trying to exchange your body for a man's material goods. Now we have a generation of women that are teaching the younger generation how to be just like them with pole dancing. Oh, that's nasty. Go on Twitter, you'll find it. I'm not going to post the video on here, but there's a video going around on Twitter right now that women are trying to justify where they're taking little girls and teaching them how to pole dance. We live in a society where women are being praised for being 304s. And the reason why so many people will get angry at this woman and angry at me and angry at other people making videos about this is because it's just like people saying, if the shoe fits, wear it. <laughs> you wouldn't get mad if this wasn't you now would you black men are in the house they are stepping up they are taking responsibility they are taking accountability it's the women that are not doing it we have a sisterhood. We have the modern day 304. They're not, I'm not going to call modern women modern women anymore. Over here, they're the modern 304s. The modern day prostitutes. Because that's what they are. And we need to call them as we see them. This is the reason why so many men are going overseas. This is the reason why. Because women over here... They exploit you for your money, for your resources, for your lifestyle. And then what do you get in return? An entitled woman. What do you get in return? A woman that can't cook. A woman that doesn't want to be a woman. A woman that wants to be masculine. A woman that doesn't understand her divine nature and how to be a woman. A woman that came from a single parent household with daddy issues and generational trauma. That is what you get when you deal with the modern 304. And so many people are going to get upset. But guess what? The truth is the truth. Two plus two is four, whether you agree with it or not. And so many people are upset with modern women. So many people are upset with the modern day 304. And I believe it's just like what I always say. It's time for us men. We've been doing it, but we need to keep doing it. If you can find a black woman in America that's not a 304 modern woman, more power to you. Anyway, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Tickle that notification bell that will let you know every time I upload content. And do not forget tomorrow night at 7 EDT, I will be live on YouTube. So stop by, say hello, leave a comment. I can't wait. And until the next video, peace.